welcome to this video, but a very special welcome to you, the James Caldwell High School Seniors, Class of 2020. You know, things are really tough right now. You're stuck at home, you can't really go anywhere, can't really do anything. We're in the middle of distance learning. There's only so much Tiger King you can watch on Netflix. Just things are really tough right now. Um, but especially for you, the seniors. You know, the last few months of your senior year are gonna be kind of crazy. As I said, you're stuck in distance learning. There's a chance that we might not be able to celebrate prom, uh, the academic banquet, the award ceremonies, spring sports, the musical, and even the risk of possibly not having a traditional graduation ceremony. So I was trying to think of something that would lift your spirits and try to make you feel better about the current circumstances. As you know, I love the senior class. I think you guys are great. And there's a lot of people out there who feel the same way. I reached out to a lot of people that you'll know, you'll recognize in this video and asked them just very simply to make a positive message about the senior class. And the response was overwhelming. I got over 75 responses from people around the community who love you the same way I do and just want to try to make you feel best about what's going on. So sit back and relax. The video is long. It's about 45 minutes long. But again, all of these people just wanted to recognize you, the senior class, and make you feel as loved as we feel about you. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hey class of 2020, we miss all of our chiefs, but we wanted to send you this special message because spring of senior year should be the best semester of all. And any anxious feelings that you have about the future should be about the wonderful opportunities that await you, not the uncertainty of whether you will ever have another normal school day within the walls of JCHS or get to walk in graduation with your friends. These are challenging times for most of us, but to paraphrase the great Martin Luther King, the ultimate measure of a person is where he stands in challenging times. This means more than just surviving. It is doing what you can to make this time better for yourself and those around you. I've said it a million times, the class of 2020 is full of extraordinary students. So continue to lead the way that you did before, just virtually. Tutoring friends, having Zoom club meetings, uh, virtual workouts. It's also the small things that you can do. Helping out at home, calling on an elderly neighbor, FaceTiming a friend in need. That will make a huge difference. The selfless things that you do is how you will remember these days and others will remember you. James Caldwell High School is more than a building. We are a tough, resilient, proud community. And we are here to support one another through conversation, laughter, 
song, whatever helps to bolster your spirit. We are called well strong. And when this is over, your class and our school will be more unified than ever. Take good care of yourself and one another. And remember, once a chief, always a chief. send my congratulations to all of you, all you great young men and women who have comprised this wonderful class. I've seen so many tributes that point out some of the negatives that have gone on since 2001, 2002 when you were born. Forget that. Through your 17, 18 years of life, so many tremendous things have occurred. Just think of technology, how much that's changed in your short lifetime. More things have happened in the last 15, 18 years than happened in the previous 100. Smartphones, smartwatches, iPads, and all of the technology that we take for granted every day. Google, YouTube, and of course, your amazing TikToks. One thing I don't want you to take for granted, I want you to don't ever take for granted the fact that you now have joined our family. There's a large circle of teachers within our building that are all graduates of JCHS. We're all very proud to have graduated from there and always will remain a chief in our hearts. And now, we're even more especially happy that no matter whether we see you in June or whether we have to graduate in some other way, we'll make sure that we understand and we're proud of that class of 2020 and that we love every one of you and we welcome you into the family. Love you all. Stay safe. Hi, James Caldwell, class of 2020. I know this isn't what you envisioned for your final year of high school, but I keep thinking of a saying that we had in the Navy. The hotter the fire, the stronger the steel. All of you are being tested. This is a crisis the likes of which our country hasn't seen uh, in generations. And yet, when I think of the last generation that faced such a crisis, World War II, I think of how many of them were tested and came out stronger. I think of my grandfather, who left college after his first year to go fly missions in Europe. He was shot down and eventually came home to raise his family. And I think of, of his sacrifice for our country, and I think about how that generation is still called the greatest generation because of all they did to lead our country. And I'm looking to you to take up that mantle. I'm looking to you who are, are being tested right now to learn the compassion and the sacrifice and the dedication to our country that we need right now to get us through this crisis and to bring us into the future. And so congratulations again on your graduation. Best of luck. And I can't wait to see the wonderful things all of you do. Thank you. Every day as your teacher, I see your compassion, your leadership, your optimism, and your dedication that you bring to not only our class, but to the community. I know that this is such a trying, uncertain time, but I also know that part of your legacy will be your resilience. It's been an honor and a privilege getting to know you. And I wanna leave you with what Maya Angelou once said, nothing can dim that light that shines from within. Well I guys, you. I think your senior prank got a little bit out of control this year, um, but based on what you guys were able to pull off, um, I know that you guys are destined for greatness. Um, I miss you and I love you and I wish you guys all the best in the future. Hey seniors, I hope you're all doing well. I miss you all. Um, I truly miss seeing you in class every day, but you're doing such a great job with remote learning and I know it's a bit different, you know, for us not to be together all the time and for you not to be able to see each other, but I want you to just try and stay positive and know that this, this too will pass and eventually we'll all be back together again. 
So just keep your chins up and keep working hard. You're doing a great job. Hi, class of 2020. It goes without saying that I miss you all so much. This is a defining moment, but it does not define you. You have so much to look forward to in the upcoming months. I know that you are all thinking about what school it is that you'll be attending in the fall and making exciting decisions. And since you can't stop by my office to tell me all about it, I hope that you will send me an email. You have so much going on. And even though I can't be with you, I wanna know how you are doing. Please stay safe, stay home, stay strong, and stay positive. Hi seniors, Mrs. Powell here. Two o oh, two o. Oh. Let's go. Over the past four years, I've witnessed a lot of this and a little bit of this and a lot of this. But at the same time, there have been great class discussions as well as wonderful energy in the hall and great, great smiles. I wish you all the best for your future. And may your life be as colorful as a rainbow. Happy graduation. Woohoo! Thank you. First of all, congratulations, seniors. You made it. I can remember the experience, excitement and nervousness. Okay, I agree that my nervousness so many years ago did not include worrying about a pandemic. Just three thoughts and messages to share. You being locked down at home with your family is a gift. Yes, you heard me, a gift. Think about it. Without being forced, you may never have spent this much time together. Okay, that's probably an exaggeration, but you are about to move on with your life. And I remember the, my high school graduation being a stepping off point in my life. Enjoy this time with family, take advantage of it. The second thought I have to share is, go figure out what your passion is. And if you don't have a passion, then do your best to find one. If that passion is in academics, arts, sciences, sports, no matter what, pursue it. Chase your dream no matter what it is and don't compromise. Lastly, my life, like most people's, has not been a straight line and has not always been successful. I've made mistakes and I've failed. We all do. You will. Just be ready to deal with it and keep on moving forward. Best of luck to all of you. Caldwell is so proud of you. Thank you. How you doing? I miss seeing your bright, shiny faces. I hope you're doing well. Hang in there and know I'm thinking about you. Stay safe and be well. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Mrs. Renzetti. I recently recovered from leukemia. I've been on some form of quarantine since 2019. You guys got this, seriously. This is, you, you are now ready for just about anything. This has been one of the best trainings you could ever have. There's nothing you can't do now. And I have faith that you're all going to be very successful in whatever you eventually decide to do. Hi all you guys, I really miss you. Every day that I don't get to spend with you is one less day of your life I get to participate in and I really miss you all. You were such a great, you are such a great senior class. You're a class that stands out all on its own before this ever happened. And there's some really, really special uh, people in your class. And I miss all of you. Seniors, I miss seeing all of you. You've been such a pleasure to both teach and be around. I wish you nothing but the best, and I hope to see you soon. Hi, members of the class of 2020. This is West Caldwell Mayor Joe Tempesta. Just giving you some greetings. I hope you and your families, I find you well, and uh, that you really keep in uh, your chin up. This is, uh, you know, obviously a, a very crazy situation that we're all facing. But you know what? I've seen a lot of you uh, over the last uh, year or so. Many of you participating in many extracurricular activities, and I'm very, very impressed with the talent that's coming out of the class of 2020. And I would tell you that I think that this particular instance that's a, a once in a, hopefully a once in a lifetime occurrence will make you better. Uh, both of you as young men and young ladies, I think are gonna benefit from this in the following fashion. When you are ready to go off to school or profession or whatever it is that you're going to do post James Caldwell High School, uh, I believe you're going to be better prepared more so than any other generation. 
And I think that that bodes well for you because I think no matter how you slice it, as I always said, there's two sides, but I believe you're going to be able to be better prepared for whether it be the kind of thing in the future if you're if you're ill or sick or even colleges or universities or even places of employment now are going to change the way we do things. And who better prepared than you? Hey, James Cole, class of 2020, it's your favorite SRO. I'm just sending you a little shout out to tell you how proud I am of all of you. I know these are tough times, but you're doing a great job. So stay positive, be strong, and hopefully we'll be seeing you very, very soon. I'm so proud of you guys. Hi, seniors. You guys have accomplished so much since ninth grade. We're all so proud of you. Please stay strong and know that we're all behind you. Bye. We miss you all. Keep working hard, keep learning, and stay strong. that we are now living through has brought about considerable suffering around the world and also close to home with our own school community losing a beloved educator, Mr. Jim Brown. We are all experiencing quite a bit of uncertainty and shock at this time. It has always been the case, however, that in the wake of disaster, humanity responds with compassion, altruism, and solidarity. If you look at the aftermath of any number of historical calamities, you will see that people inevitably start working together, looking out for their neighbors, and just trying to make things better. I know that in this case, you all will not only be part of that rebuilding, but will be leaders in it. Hello, seniors. I hope this message finds you all safe and well. I'm sure I speak for my colleagues when I say we would love to be with you, but the present situation prevents us from doing that. It is a time for you to stay strong. It is a time for you to stay focused. This is just a part of your life. It's the beginning of the book. It's not the final chapter. You still have to write that. Stay strong, stay healthy, stay safe, and God bless. Hi seniors, Ms. Wenger here sitting in my garden, and as you can tell, it's spring. Spring's a time of renewal and growth, and soon it's gonna be your time. You're gonna sprout towards the sun, and you're gonna anchor those roots, and you're gonna turn into the beautiful flower, just like my daffodils there. Something unique and something special that people who helped cultivate you are going to appreciate their entire life. But what's more important is not only the people who helped you, but people who pass by your garden. You will make a difference. Hello, seniors. It's me, Schechter. Um, I first would like to tell you, well, to say hi, and also to tell you how appreciative I am to have gotten the opportunity to teach many of you, um, to get to know you through sports. I also would like to tell you that you're not alone, that we'll get through this, and uh, that I love you. Congratulations and best wishes to the class of 2020. Hey, senior class, Mr. Laura here. Just wanted to come on here and say, um, 
keep up the good work. I've been following all of you guys and all your great things on Mr. Bertolo's Instagram page. I miss you all very much. And um, I just want to say keep on keeping on. Keep plugging away. Keep doing what you know how to do best. Stay safe. And um, good luck in everything that you guys are doing. And I hope to see you all very soon. Hard to see the light now. Just don't let it go. Things will come out right now. We can make it so. Congratulations, James Caldwell High School Class of 2020. It's a marvelous accomplishment. I'm very proud of you. Uh, Washington and Lincoln students may not know who I am. I am Mr. Kena, the principal of Wilson School. Jefferson students, look close. I'm the guy that kicked the ball way over your head about seven years ago in our kickball game. Now you remember me. And of course, lots of love to the Wilson School fifth grade class of 2013. I still have lots of cards and notes and photos of our time together at Wilson School. Again, congratulations to all on a job well done. Hi kids, Pressy Poo here with my little furry friends. I just wanted to say to you that I know that this year has been incredibly hard and you guys have been incredibly strong and brave and I want you to know just how proud I am of you. You have managed to get through a really, really difficult time in life for everybody. And it's been hard. It's really been hard. But I want you to know that I am so happy for you that you're moving on to this next most wonderful phase of your life. Hi, seniors. I just wanted to say the biggest congratulations this, I know, has been a tough year, but you should take in all of your accomplishments and be so proud of them. I'm so proud of you. I wish I could be there to celebrate with you as you reach this amazing milestone. But just know that we, your teachers, are always here for you, whether near or far, and wishing you all the best in the future. Congratulations and cheers to you. Hola, the World Language Department is here to talk to all of you seniors and to send our best wishes and love to all of you. I'd like to send a special message out to my senior cheerleaders. Uh, I hope you take your call chief spirit with you wherever you go. Hi everybody, Senora Blanchard. I wanna wish everybody luck next year. We're gonna miss seeing your faces all through the hallways. And I feel like we got gypped this year not seeing you for these couple months. Um, a special shout out to my seniors this year, Jack, Jake, Anthony, and Squeeze. And also last year, Kate, Emily, Derek, Jake, and Peyton. We had some good times together and I'll really miss you guys. Hola a todos. This is Senora Cougar Russell. Um, I want to shout out to all the seniors. I know a lot of you, whether you've been in my class or not. A special shout out to my swimmers that, have, that are graduating. Um, I'm missing you all. Y claro que a mi clase de español AC y a mi senior en español 4, los extraño mucho. Estoy muy orgullosa de ustedes y les deseo buena suerte. Hi, everybody, Senora uh, Jampino Vasi. I just want to say buena suerte to all of my, all, everybody who I had, all my students, especially my Spanish 5 and especially my four special lacrosse seniors. Whatever you do in the future, remember to make mama proud. Ragazzi miei, whether you had me as Ms. Bergman's replacement in Spanish or you have me in Italian last year, I want to wish you guys buona fortuna, buena suerte, good luck in all that you do. 
Keep reaching high, reach for the stars, and you'll always get there. Lots of luck to you. Ragazzi, signorina Manfre, allora, mi mancate da morire tutti alla classe di 2020. Un cuore grandissimo per voi e anche per il nostro signor Brown. Ragazzi, in bocca al lupo, vi vogliamo bene. Mm -hmm. Um, it's hard to believe that four years ago uh, you guys walked through those front doors at JCHS and I know that you know that that time has gone so, so quickly. Uh, just think about how much you've grown over these years. Um, this is only the beginning. Um, move forward. Be the best person that you can. Um, help those that are less fortunate. Most of all, love and show your love to everyone around you for everyone hang in there as my grandmother used to say this too shall pass and to quote a song one day you'll be old think of all the stories that you will have told because you are living history this one is one for the history books catch you on the flip side of corona you guys have had one heck of a year this year. Just know that if you can survive this year, you can survive just about anything. I wish you the best of luck in your future, and I hope you guys come back and visit us, because we're going to miss you. Good luck, guys. That's the 2020. Miss ya. Um, it's Miss Wilson from Guidance taking a walk. I thought I'd stop, because now the camera's shaking, from taking a walk and let you look at some of the little things in life. Um, sometimes there's surprises. Sometimes good, sometimes not so good, but... I miss seeing all of you stop in guidance. I wish you nothing but the best. It's going to be better. It's going to be brighter because you're going to make it happen. Take care. Congratulations to all of the James Caldwell High School graduates, to my Lincoln School students. I went back and reviewed the promotion speech from when you were in fifth grade, and I talked about how in about six or seven years, you would have opportunities to do things like drive, vote, get jobs, move on to college, and the time is here. I'm so proud of the Lincoln students and all of the graduates once again. On behalf of my school and our community, I want to congratulate you and wish you the best of luck. As you go through life, explore, challenge, put yourself out there. I guarantee you the only things you're going to regret at the end of your life, at the end of senior year, at the end of college, are the things that you didn't do due to fear, insecurities, doubt or some discrepancy between who you know yourself to be and who you're portraying to the world. So be you, love yourself, do it now. Hey seniors, I just wanna take a minute to let you guys know how proud I am of each and every one of you. You guys have been with me from the very beginning of my teaching career when you guys were in eighth grade at Grover Cleveland Middle School. And to say that I'm gonna miss you guys is truly an understatement. You guys have been my favorite class to teach through and through and I am honored to have been your teacher over the past five years. I wish you guys all the luck and success in the future after graduation, and please feel free to come back and visit. You know where to find me. Hi, senior class. Your assistant superintendent, Mrs. Jones, just sending you a quick video. Hello. I hope you're doing well. We miss seeing you. Thank you for all the good work that we know that you're doing your best at home to accomplish and we can't wait to see you soon. Hey, class of 2020, seniors. Hope you're doing okay. I'm taking a walk, and you know, I came to Memorial Park, and they have all these beautiful rocks somebody had done, and they say, courage, stay strong, Caldwell strong. I mean, that's what we are. We're Caldwell strong, and you guys got this. Hey, class of 2020, with a special hello, to you Wildcats from your Washington School principal. What a great bunch of kids you are. You're creative, you're smart, you're funny, you're energetic, all traits that will serve you well during these times. As your principal, let me give you some advice though. First of all, be kind. Do not describe your parents' work from home outfits. Be grateful that weird dinner of canned tuna and pasta and whatever that sauce was, still better than this, the food at the James Caldwell High School cafeteria, I think. Keep up your standards. No, wearing the same socks all week long does not keep the laundry down. Most of all, laugh. 
laugh alone, laugh with friends digitally, laugh with your family. But you do not need to stomp on that package of ketchup to create that laugh. It worked for you at Washington School, but you're past that now, I hope. Stay wildcat strong. Remember, once a wildcat, always a wildcat. Good luck to the class of 2020. Your teachers miss you. Hope to see you soon. of 2020 mr huff here checking in just wanted to let you guys know that we're thinking about you we know that this is a very tough situation for everyone but we're going to get through it i know this isn't how you expected your senior year to go especially as we go into the fourth marking period but i just want to remind you guys to stay healthy stay safe stay active okay get outside as much as you can safely of course um find a hobby do your work, obviously, when we come back from spring break, and just take care of yourselves. You know, the we're all in this together. The whole country's in this together, the whole state. So let's persevere. Let's do the best that we can. Hi, JCHS seniors. It's hard sometimes to find the light to guide you through the dark times. That's when I hope you can remember you guys are the light. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Hi, class of 2020. I hope this message finds you safe and well. So during uncertain times, what we have to hold on to is what we know for certain. And what is certain is that the teachers, staff, and administration all love you and support you and want you to pursue all your dreams. So, so stay safe. Be strong, and we'll see you soon. Senior class of 2020, you will never be forgotten. But here's a secret. We would never have forgotten you anyway. You guys were wonderful to see in class and in the halls every day. You made it a pleasure to come to work. So now you get to go forward and live your life, and the future is long. Go do things, everyday things, mundane things extraordinary things they all await for you this is just one small part of the amazing stories you have to tell go live them be well hi seniors we are really missing you right now um, as mr devlin said right before we left you guys are an extraordinary class and this just really bums all of us out that we are not able to spend this time with you and get to celebrate you the way that we really would want to. Um, hopefully we can get together soon and I hope that at home you are staying safe, staying positive, and staying healthy. Hope to see you guys soon. Bye. I'm sure none of you could have ever envisioned that your senior year would turn out like this. I do hope to see you again soon, but if not, Please know it's been a pleasure getting to know all of you over the past four years. I have no doubt in my mind that you will find a way to turn this experience into something positive as you journey into adulthood. Because after all, you are our future and we are counting on you. Hey everyone, this message is for my varsity girls basketball players, Carly, Kat, Mac, Emma, and Gap. Hope you girls are doing well. Really miss seeing you every day, but I'm grateful we were able to finish off our season together. 
I know in these crazy times, you girls will rise above and make the most out of these unusual circumstances, just like you did on the court. You did the little things that we needed to do. You gave 100% effort and you believed in yourselves. I know you'll do the same with these circumstances and I hope to see everyone soon. And does anybody know where the defensive duck is? Seniors, continue to work hard, do your best, and great things are sure to come. Please do not allow the recent events that have altered how you will conclude your secondary education to dampen thoroughly your vibrant minds, hearts, and spirits. Yes, there is cause for dissatisfaction, disconsolation, and discouragement. But, my dear students, there is also cause, I posit greater cause, for celebration. Celebration? You may ask. Dr. Trouse, how is this possible? Possible and warranted, I reply. Your intellect, goodness, and character demand so. Hey, JCHS seniors and Woodshop seniors, been missing you all very much. The young are strong and resilient. With family and friends, we'll all get through this together. Stay strong, be well, peace. Hey seniors, we are thinking about you all the time. We can't wait to get to see you guys again. You are the best. Hang in there. This whole community is going to be there for you when this thing is lifted. Okay. Hey class of 2020, uh, undeniable crazy year. Uh, hope we get back in school. You get to at least see uh, each other one less time before you head off to do what you're going to do in this world. But if you can make it through this, I'm sure you can make it through anything. Best of luck, class of 2020. Seniors, I know things are a bit strange at the moment, but rest assured, this will all be some weird punctuation mark found somewhere in the story that you are all writing. I am lucky to have had the opportunity to teach so many of you as freshmen and again as juniors and seniors. Uh, and I'm grateful for all the joy and laughter that you guys have brought into my classroom. So thank you. Uh, Robin Williams said that the bad times help us realize all the good stuff that we hadn't been paying attention to. So I urge you guys to take this time and focus on all the good things that you've done and get excited about all the great things that you will do. Thank you guys for being a great group. I wish you the best of luck and you will be missed. I just want to tell you that no matter what happens with this situation, you should be so proud of yourselves that you have gotten through this, that you're gonna graduate and start your new lives. You've worked very hard to do this. Be proud of yourselves just as much as I am of you. Live every day happy. Do things that you love, no matter how much money it is. I know that every single day that I go into my job, I love it. No matter what crazy things might happen during the day. I genuinely love my job and I love all of you guys. Hey seniors, I hope everybody's doing well. I miss all of you. Looking forward to getting back hopefully before school gets out. Um, know that I'm thinking about you guys and I wish you the best of luck in this difficult time. See you soon. Hello, James Caldwell, high school class of 2020. This is Mr. McGeehan, vice principal of Grove Clinton Middle School. I just wanted to take a moment for myself and the entire GCMS family and say congratulations and wish you the best of luck on any journey you take through life. Hello seniors, this is Miss Bambor and Priscilla and Por Percy reporting in to tell you that we miss you and we hope that you are getting to enjoy the simple pleasures in life so that you are able to uh, think of this time as a time to refresh and renew. Uh, you know, I know this year hasn't gone the way any of us expected, um, but it's definitely a reminder that we can't control the cards that were dealt in life. We only control how we play them. Uh, and that your particular strengths uh, as a community, you guys care about each other, you care about your school, you care about your families. Um, as much as it's tempting to focus on what you've lost, sometimes it's helpful to think about what you've gained uh, and what you've been able to, to grow and to improve as the years have gone on. 
uh, really, you know, this is your moment to shine. This is uh, your generation's moment to step up to the plate, and you guys are knocking it out of the park. Hey, seniors and athletes, now's the time to fall back on your training. You faced tough competition before, and you have it in you to keep fighting through the obstacles we now face. Lean on your teammates and family for support, and that bond should carry you through now more than ever. Appreciate what you do have and live to the fullest measure every day. And remember, life isn't about waiting for the storm to pass. It's about learning how to dance in the rain. To the James Caldwell High School, class of 2020, even though your high school career has unceremoniously come to a close here, on the bright side, uh, in, in a couple of months, I'll be able to accept those of you who have requested to follow me on Instagram, so that's great. But on a serious note, um, just wanted to say that I've been blessed these past two years to get to know so many of you so closely. I know you're going to do great things. I know you're going to be able to keep in touch with each other even better because of, you know, all the zoom in and things that are going on because of the coronavirus. But, um, uh, you're going to do great things. I'm sorry that this is, you know, happening and this is how it's coming to an end, but it was a great ride all in all and i'm happy to have been a part of it and i know you're going to do great things lots of love first let me start by saying how much i truly miss seeing all your faces in our hallways each and every day i've had the pleasure of having so many of you in my classes and i've enjoyed our time together and know you'll go on to do great things here in caldwell we have such a special community where we're forever chiefs and always connected I wish you all the best of luck, health, and happiness as you journey to your next chapter in life, building new connections and making your impact on the world. Hey, class of 2020. So now it's your turn to get out there and improve the world, fix the future, and make life better than ever. Congratulations. Hey, seniors. Mrs. Callahan here. I miss you all. Wish we were all together. But... I wanted you to remember that you have shared many memories at James Colwell High School and you have many friendships that you will enjoy for a lifetime. So just a couple of pages of the yearbook which has been completed and has been sent in. Right, so hopefully it's getting printed and hopefully we'll all see this in the next couple of months. But here you are, these are your memories. Miss you all. Take care. Stay healthy.
Hey senior class, Mr. Maroon here. You've been an exceptional class from freshman year to senior year in so many different ways. Just follow your passions in life, whatever that might be, and you'll find great success. Congratulations on your graduation. Hey guys, it totally makes sense if you're freaking out right about now. But take a deep breath. Everything will work out. The end of the year is going to be weird, and it will still be awesome because it's your senior year. And next year, wherever you're headed, you're going to do amazing things. So don't forget to come back and say hi. We miss you. Good luck, guys. To the James Caldwell High School class of 2020. These are challenging times for all as we are forced to navigate a new path brought upon us by this pandemic. Each of us has our own way of processing the flood of emotions that has derailed our accustomed routines. And all of this falls upon us as you are embarking on your last leg of schooling towards graduation. Although the way you envisioned the months leading to your milestone is not what you expected, the work you have accomplished in the classroom these past 12 years will not be abandoned. In your years as middle schoolers, I witnessed firsthand the incredible potential you harness. I have no doubt you continued on the path while at JCHS. I have faith that you will press on, committed to making your mark as the years unfold. As for today, though we can't embrace our classmates, we can embrace our faith. Though we can't hear the customary din in the hallways, we can hear the symphony of nature. Though we can't run to the aid of our medical workers, we can applaud their efforts through social media. Though this virus has limits, we, working collectively, are limitless. I pray for everyone's safe journey through these unprecedented times. Hey Chiefs, I just want you to know that I'm thinking about you right now and I know everything seems scary in the world and uncertain, but remember to always look for the light in the darkness as things are going to get better. We're going to overcome this. You're always going to see people helping each other at times like this. So again, look for the light in the darkness. Know this is going to pass. We will overcome. Be well, stay strong. Hi seniors, it's been great getting to know so many of you this year. I just wanted to say congratulations on your graduation and your accomplishments. And don't let the events of the world overshadow your successes. Best of luck for the future. Hi seniors, it's Miss McNamara. I hope you're all doing well. I just wanted to let you all know that I miss you so much. And I hope that you and your families are staying safe staying healthy, staying positive. We're all gonna get through this together and I hope to be seeing you guys sooner than Hello later. class of 2020, this is Mrs. Brown. Miss all of you. Um, just wanted to say we're all very proud of you, how you have uh, overcome all the obstacles along the way with remote learning. Um, you guys have a lot of stamina and this is gonna help you on the new pathways that you're gonna be encountering in the future. And you all have that intellectual ability that will also guide you along the way. Hello class of 2020, Crazy Mr. Russinello here. I want to congratulate you and wish you all the best in your success in your future. Remember my crazy saying, there's more than one way to skin a cat? Well, there's more than one way to solve a problem. And you will get through this problem and succeed in anything and everything that you set your mind to. And you can and will accomplish all your goals and your dreams. I wish you the best of luck in the future. God bless, Godspeed, go Chiefs. Hey guys, it's Mrs. Spina. I just wanted to say how proud I am of you and all you've accomplished and all you will continue to accomplish. Times may be tough right now, but tough times don't last, tough people do. Keep your heads up, the best is yet to come. You all have amazing futures ahead. Bye. To the class of 2020, the future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of their dreams. That's a quote by Eleanor Roosevelt, and I dedicate it to all of you. Don't stop dreaming, and remember, once a chief, always a chief. Hey, senior class. It's hard to believe that it's already been one month since the last time we saw each other. And every day does get a little more challenging because I know we're getting one day closer to the end of your senior year. I've been telling you this for the past four years, and I mean it every time I say it, you truly are my favorite class. You guys treat each other with respect. You treat me with respect. We have a lot of fun. It's just, it's been a blast these past four years and it's hard to believe 
that this is possibly how it's all going to end. But I want you to think about the positives. I want you to think about all the fun memories you've had. I want you to think about all the great stuff that you've been through. And I want you to think about how much you're appreciated by all the administration, especially me. I mean, who else would let this happen to them in a gymnasium full of 800 students in the middle of the court? Not just once, not just twice, but three times for your enjoyment so that you can get a good laugh and look back down the road and say, wow, I remember senior year when Mr. Bertolo got pied in the face three times. I would also be remiss if I didn't personally thank Griffin and Dom for single-handedly making my Instagram account go from 100 followers to where I currently sit right now, over 900 followers. But in all seriousness, there were over 75 people who contributed to this video because you really are a great senior class. So in closing, be well, be safe, and enjoy open campus because you now have the ability to go out and get lunch whenever you want, any day of the week. See you guys soon.